Ever wonder why your poodle looks at you like you're the one who should be fetching the ball? Yes, you've entered the paradoxical world of poodles where your four-legged friend often seems to be the one pulling the strings. You see, owning a poodle is like living with a furry four-legged comedian who's convinced they're the brains of the operation. Let's talk lifespan. Poodles live an average of 12 to 15 years. Some cynics might say they stick around just to outwit their owners for a few more rounds of fetch. But we reckon it's because they know they're onto a good thing with their plush beds, gourmet meals and adoring humans at their beck and call. So are you ready to unravel the mysteries of this fluffy enigma? Buckle up as we dive into the world of poodles where every day is a stand-up comedy show. Are you a big dog person or a small dog person? Well, with poodles, you can be both. Poodles come in three different sizes, standard, miniature and toy. Standard poodles are the largest, standing over 15 inches tall and weighing between 40 and 70 pounds. Now that's a lot of dog. Miniature poodles, on the other hand, are a bit more diminutive, standing 10 to 15 inches tall and weighing between 10 and 15 pounds. Last but not least, we have the toy poodles, the smallest of the bunch, standing no more than 10 inches tall and weighing a mere 4 to 6 pounds. But don't let their size fool you. These pint-sized pups have egos that could rival a Great Dane's. It's almost as if the size of a poodle's ego is directly proportional to its size. A toy poodle might be small, but in their mind, they're a towering giant. Remember, no matter the size, every poodle thinks they're the king or queen of the house. Ever met a poodle? Then you've met a drama queen. Poodles are the personification of high-spirited vivacity, mixed with a dash of diva-esque flair. Imagine having a housemate like Elton John or Lady Gaga and you get the picture. They're eccentric, energetic and never shy away from the spotlight. These dogs have a temperament as bouncy as their springy curls. They're always up for a game of fetch or a brisk walk around the block. Their energy levels put even the most diligent gym goers to shame. If you don't keep them engaged, they might just start doing somersaults in your living room or chasing their tails just for a laugh. Poodles require regular exercise not just to keep their waistlines in check, but also to stimulate their sharp minds. Forget about lazing around on the couch all day, these dogs are no couch potatoes. They'd rather be out exploring the world or learning new tricks. In short, owning a poodle is like living with a hyperactive furry gymnast. Oh, think you're a foodie? Wait till you meet a poodle. These canine connoisseurs have a palate that would put Michelin star chefs to the test. They're not just chowing down on any old kibble, oh no, they demand the creme de la creme of doggy diets, but don't let their gourmet tastes fool you. Poodles, like any breed, have their health quirks. They're prone to issues like hip dysplasia and certain types of eye diseases, but do they let that slow them down? Not a chance. They carry on gallivanting around like they're invincible. It's as if they've got a tiny superhero cape hidden under those curly locks. One moment they're battling a squeaky toy, the next they're leaping off the sofa like a pint-sized action hero. So, if you own a poodle, you're not just a pet owner, you're a personal chef to a very discerning diner. Want a guard dog? Get a poodle. They might not scare the burglar away, but they'll certainly critique their fashion choices. Now. You may be wondering about the family-friendly aspect of poodles. Well, they're like the Mary Poppins of the canine world. Practically perfect in every way. They're gentle and patient with children, and they get along swimmingly with other pets. You might be thinking, but I live in a small apartment. Fear not, for poodles are quite adaptable. They're just as comfortable in a city flat as they are romping around in a sprawling backyard. However, they do enjoy a good run around, so some form of exercise is a must. But what's this paradox we've been hinting at? Well, it's the fact that this breed, known for its regal appearance and aristocratic behaviour, is an absolute clown at heart. They'll keep you laughing with their antics and charm you with their wit. Owning a poodle is like having a furry roommate who pays rent in laughs and love. Think owning a poodle is cheap? Think again, they have a champagne taste on a beer budget. Now let's talk money. The initial cost of purchasing a poodle can range anywhere from a few hundred to several thousand dollars depending on the breeder and the pedigree of the dog. It's like buying a luxury car. Sure, you could go for the budget model, but the fully loaded version with all the bells and whistles is so much more appealing. But the costs don't stop at the purchase price. Oh no, my friend, poodles are high-maintenance dogs. 
They need professional grooming every four to six weeks, which can run you between $50 and $100 a pop. Over a year, you're looking at spending the equivalent of a decent vacation on keeping your poodle looking sharp. Then there's the food. Poodles have a sophisticated palate and do best on high-quality, grain-free kibble or a raw food diet. It's like they're dining at a five-star restaurant every day. It's not exactly the dollar menu at your local fast food joint. Healthcare costs are another factor. Poodles are prone to certain health issues like hip dysplasia, epilepsy and Addison's disease, to name a few. Regular vet checkups, vaccinations, dental care and potential treatment for these conditions can add up to a significant amount over the dog's lifetime. Don't forget about training. Poodles are intelligent and eager to please, but they also have a stubborn streak. You might need to invest in a professional trainer or at least a few good training books. And then there's the toys, the beds, the leashes, the collars. The list goes on. It's like having a child who never grows up and moves out of the house. So, owning a poodle may cost a pretty penny, but the joy and laughter they bring are priceless. And really, can you put a price on unconditional love, companionship, and a fluffy friend who thinks you're the greatest thing since sliced bread? I think not. Ever wondered what your poodle thinks of you? Well, let's hear it straight from the horse's, I mean, dog's mouth. Imagine, if you will, a world seen through the eyes of a poodle. To them, size isn't a matter of feet and inches, it's about how big the love is that they receive. When it comes to personality, they fancy themselves as the canine equivalent of a royal, with a dash of clownish humour. As connoisseurs, they might think of their diet as a five-star menu, hand-picked for their royal palate. They'd tell you that their health isn't just about avoiding trips to the vet, but also about getting their daily dose of play and cuddles. In their world, they're not just family pets. They're the guardians, the entertainers, and the best friends. And about the cost? Well, they'd probably say, darling, you can't put a price on this level of fabulousness. And there you have it, a glimpse into the hilariously confusing world of poodles. Remember, in a poodle's world, they're the star, and we're just the supporting cast.